where I can only be in one place with antics like that. It's the Defeat Socks booth here in Inter by 2018, talking to the illustrious and handsome Shane Cooper. Man who, from the very beginning, has made Pez socks. We have never received Pez socks from any other supplier. This is like, I'm talking about 50 or 60 years ago. Wow. Yeah. In fact, I'm wearing some now. First of all, what is that awesome vest you're wearing? Oh, you like my vest? This is my beautiful undie light sublimated Alexander Julian. It looks like a sweater, yeah. but it's not. It's a defeat undie light. Check that out. We're working with Alexander Julian on a brand new product range. Yeah. Don't you just love that gorgeous product? So this awesome. is an undershirt. Love it. Yeah. So it's so it's a base layer. It's a base layer. It's a base layer. Yeah. But it looks like an outer layer. It looks like pure sex, but we won't say that, okay? It, <laughs> we haven't even had any moonshine. No moonshine, no. A, no. Anyway, so let's get back to the product. Would you recommend these in all temperatures or...? Yes, absolutely. As a, as a base layer, it creates a, a second layer, a second system inside your jersey, uh, like a second microclimate. It keeps you cooler or warmer. Very nice product. Very and likely. how much would this cost? Uh, about 55 bucks. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Love the base layers, but it's all about the socks. So, here we have the brand new Evo Ventoux. This is our new super lightweight sock, perfect for hot days. This was tested on Team Quick Step. They started wearing these socks at the Tour of California, and they won the Tour of California. Wow, okay. Right? Yeah. Yeah, and so the very first day this sock was worn, it, was, it won the stage of the Tour of California. And then uh, Ala Philippe uh, won the polka dot jersey, wearing the lightest sock in the world. We work with Team Quick Step. Uh, they, they do all the testing of our product. Yeah. But this sock is available in the Ventoux and the Classique, and we also have it available in the Carmel. And what is the price of that sock, if I may ask? Good question. <laughs> uh, $19.99. Ooh, that's a good price. Yes. Okay. All right. And you've got some other fancy socks. We finally perfected Ooh, sublimation wow. in a sock. Look at that. The graphics on this product are incredible. This sock is direct to consumer only and it's $19.99 as well. It's a very thin sock and the graphics are gorgeous. We have lots of styles to choose from. I'm sorry, but I've got to touch this sock. I'm like, is it, what's the material? That, that is, that is a lightweight polyester that, that sublimates very well. Okay. Uh, we don't, it's, it's also has the flat toe seam model, so there's no toe seam. Ah, uh, a very nice feature. How does this sock breathe compared to some of your other socks? I mean, polyester is an excellent looking material, pulls moisture away from your body. Should be pretty comfortable, I'm thinking. Richard, that is a very good question. It does wick moisture, but it also breathes because we use the patented aerator mesh weave, oh. and it allows the foot vapor to escape into the, the, the shoe. And nobody else has that. It's patented. Yeah. <laughs> And you've got another sock in your hand. Yes, the dirt. At least bagger. I think that's a sock. Whoops. Yes. Th this is the dirt bagger. The dirt bagger. The dirt bagger is made of 50 50. There we, here we are. Here we are. 50 50 uh, poly wool blend. And it is a heathered color. Beautiful sock. Ooh, poly wool. You know, I love, I love wool socks, especially coming from the rainy climes of Vancouver. It is the sock to wear in the wintertime. So, well, and what happens uh, is with this particular wool, it's not going to absorb as much if you step in a puddle because of the polyester okay. content. Okay. But look at the, the style on this sock. We have this available in lots of different colorways. My feet are feeling warmer already, actually. They're feeling good, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, I'm not even, even, nice, I'm not even nice wearing thing. those socks. What is the name of that sock again? I was going to call it a woolly ear, but it's not, is it? Actually, this is a woolly ear. You were right. It is a Wooliator. Catchy name. We love yes, Wooliator. Um, okay. And I will have to check the uh, Price check online, online. six. <laughs> People buy these online? Right? Yes, absolutely. We're all in stock. And the okay. unique thing about Defeat is we make all of our own product in an 80 mile radius of Defeat. And we use That's all local vendors for And Defeat, yeah. where is your head of headquarters located? It's somewhere in the United States. Yes, we are in North Carolina. We are in Hildebrand, North Carolina, which is just uh, north of, of, of Hickory. And that means you'll be exempt from any tariffs on foreign goods that may appear in the future. <laughs> no tariffs, but we did have a hurricane that we escaped this week. So it's good. People that are suffering from the hurricane in North and South Carolina, we're thinking about you. We hope that you recover soon. Right on. Okay, Shane, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Rich. Cheer on Pants. All right.